That's what it looks like when you take the Brady Bunch camping. Their first backpacking trip. should be right up here. Looks like there's a couple cars here already. We are here. We made it. Yay. After about four and a half, five hours, we are here in New York, Catskill Mountains. You guys ready for your first backpacking overnight trip? And the dog? Okay. So we made it, and I put all my packs on the back of the car because we had a extra rider. The famous Rose Dog. You ready to go? You want to come out already, don't you? Are you excited? Oh man, oh boy. Are you guys ready to get your hiking clothes on? Yeah. All right. Here? Yeah, they can do that. Heavy pack this time, carrying three liters of extra water, a tent that I don't need, and extra food and snacks for these kids. Good lord. I think it added about 15 pounds <laughs> or more. I think it feels about 20. Oh, I don't need this sweatshirt. That stinks. All right. A do rag is all messed up. <laughs> Look, I had a ponytail or something. What do you have to do that? Uh, you gotta register that way. The ranger wants to know how many people come and visit this trail, or you know, something happened. Maybe they would know that you were there. But I think it's just to see how many people visit this area. Really. Alright, so the kids have already started complaining about their Ow. so heavy backpacks, which really aren't. I never said that. I never said that. What happened? I never said that. So what? That my backpack was heavy. <laughs> now more whiny. <laughs> Had to rig up a belt for Nikki with some paracords. The pants are too big. <laughs> Guess we can try those on first. Guess that's first tip. Make sure your kids' pants fit before you take them on the trail. It's kind of cool. You're correct. The uh, fallen tree has kind of like made like this little spout for the water. Ooh. Ooh. Go ahead.
Sarah, be so proud of these dangerous water crossings. <laughs> Bella almost took an L. <laughs> Look at these kids blowing noses. Do not do my privacy stuff. What are you talking about, nose blower? Oh! Nice I'll hat. Be quiet, <laughs> please, <first user. laughs> hey, you know, she's a How are them hiking shoes working out? So obviously, just like an adult, it's important to have nice hiking shoes. So we got all the kids real hiking shoes. Lily, Come you okay? Come on over. What's the matter? We're already done. Why are you throwing a hissy fit? Come over here and we'll they get you gloves. Warm up. Come over here and I'll get you gloves. <laughs> wow. <laughs> you just took in all that water and mixed all the rocks. You need gloves? Yes. All right, so far we've learned to make sure when you have kids on the trail that you have tissues. Good thing for mom, she had them. Cause I didn't think about that because uh, I do the old <sniffs> or ah, but uh, they're a little more delicate and I've already bought them good hiking boots we were gonna do sneakers but if we would have brought sneakers they already stepped in water and they would have been soaked so that worked out and we also learned to make sure that your kids try on pants before they come because obviously they've changed since the spring and summer Nikki's pants were too big because they were brand new and we never tried them on, so I had to use some paracord to tie a belt. Um, and luckily, Lily's pants had adjustable things in there, but they were almost too big also. So, we learn as we go. Oh, Lily's hands were cold. We put gloves on there already. So even though I don't think I need gloves, and I didn't bring them, little kids, they... Uh, they're delicate, so she has her gloves on already, and Bella has her hat on already. Snack time. What are you eating? Everybody's got some what? Sour Patch, Sour Patch Kids. Sour Patch Kids? Sour Patch Kids! Are they good? And they're puffy. Uh, too sour, but... And candy. Eating? It'll give me enough sugar. That's right. Sugar is good when you're on the trail. Not at home, though. Go over what's uh, what's in these packs. So Lily is carrying clothes, a sleeping bag, and a pad. And to help out, she's also carrying the water filter. Yes. Bella is carrying her clothes and a sleeping bag and a pad. And she's helping out by carrying six ketchup packets. <laughs> Nikki's bag okay. has his clothes sleeping bag, sleeping pad, and he's helping by carrying the extra fuel can canisters, and there's three of them because they're, you know, a little empty, you know, they're the extra ones, so I didn't want to buy new ones, we just are doing one night, so I brought some extra ones to wear out, and an extra little baby water, and I feel like I put something else in there I doesn't know about, I can't remember. Mom is carrying half the extra food. And I'm carrying all the snacks, half the food, and an extra tent, and an extra three liters of water. Ding. You kids are tearing my legs up. When are you guys going to get bigger so you can carry your own stuff? Yeah. Especially you, little one. Hey, she's Blame doing a good job. You are doing a good job. First trip. Ew. What? <laughs>
show them the way. I'll come up there and get you. Hold on. Alright, Rosie is super tired from the trip. She is knocked out. Hey, Rosie. Rose. <laughs> and over here, we got uh, the tent. That the kids are going to sleep in with the dog so she can stay warm and protect them. Look at that view. It's beautiful. Over here we got the uh, hammock set up for mom, the Hennessy. And then over here we got the dream hammock, which uh, I'm going to have a video on that separately going over that. That's my new hammock. Man, look at that view. Hey, kids. Big lake. Ew. Past the dark trees. See where it still looks sunny out there? Yeah. See the water? No. Oh, that's awesome. Don't get down on my phone. Oh. Hey. You're too scared me. Oh, that's awesome. You ready for dinner? Oh, yeah. You are. Good night, guys. Good night. We love you. Love you It is 7.13 and that sunrise is about to happen. Yay! Oh beautiful.
And last night, as you guys saw, it definitely snowed and hailed and rained and everything's wet. So taking down the tent with 37 degree weather being wet, my hands got pretty cold, but I've dealt with this before. The kids have not, and I think this is pretty rough on them because they feel like they're going to die no matter what I tell them, even though they're not going to. But they've never experienced anything uncomfortable like this before. So this is a good experience for them because anything else we do will be amazing. As you can see, I am walking with the breakfast because the girls and us were too cold and they just wanted to walk back to the car. So that's what we're doing. We're all just kind of going back to the car. <sighs> Well, it's going to be a while, but we'll stop Ooh, somewhere car. and get breakfast. All right, so we uh, almost back to the car, and we totally uh, learned a lot from this trip with the kids because who would have guessed that it was going to snow and hail and we were going to wake up and it was freezing because the weather report didn't say that at all. But I already know that the mountains can be unpredictable. And I brought gloves and snow pants for the kids, but I didn't bring heavy gloves and I could have over prepared, but I didn't. And they were cold to begin with, so we ended up not eating breakfast when we were supposed to and carrying that and trying to get off the mountain. And now everybody's fine, as you can see. But it was a rough start. So just like any other time you're with the kids, over prepare. Just like a big mama purse, will carry extra stuff in your pack, which I already did have, but even more. I think that's the biggest lesson. But overall, I think they had a good time. They challenged themselves. I think they're proud of what they did. Although there was some crying at times. I'm pretty proud of them. They did a good job, Nikki, Lily, and Bella. Thanks for watching Trail Killer. Until next time. All right, let's get done with the rest of this heist. On the count of three, it's family. Rose, come. Rose! Oh. 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 One, two, two three, family. family. All right, let's get done.